Hi hello namaste Hope you people are doing very good Now we are talking about bust weight Internally every camera has its own buffer inside the camera That means it's a small storage space while you are capturing images continuously the Im store the images get stored into the buffer it's an initial stage and later on the images that stored in the buffer move to the memory card that's later on <laughs> the processing speed of buffer is very high when compared to the memory card that's why every camera has its own buffer suppose we take an example for like a wild photographer capturing an images continuously of some animal like that it's moving like very fast in that you need to capture every every moment of that <laughs> during the capturing of the images the buffer gets heavy like uh, then what the camera do is it slow down the frame rate so friends we are using now 5300 camera in continuous shooting mode we can notice the reduce in the frame rate in this camera so let us take some other example like if we are we are having some view here right so we are having there over mountains there some pond is there and we going to capture the image here okay <laughs> and we 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 don't need to ca capture the image continuously because there is not required it is not required it is not mandatory here okay whereas in case of uh, wild photography there is there is uh, it's mandatory to capture the images continuously because there is some motion is there while animals are moving we need to capture it okay so in this case like we are uh, talking about this mountain right in this case what happens is we we took some picture that gets stored into the buffer and from buffer it will move into the memory card so there is no like a uh, buffer won't get filled up because it's a slow process we are taking some image which is not continuous that is the case with this uh, scenario suppose uh, let us take some other scenario okay like we are we are shooting some images in basic mode like not basic actually it's a quality quality of images is basic that means buffer can handle lot of photos when we move to other fine fine quality setting like it is a somewhat high high quality setting than basic in that case buffer is capable of storing the images in lesser amount while we are moving to forward like uh, in higher higher quality images like raw buffer will store the images in less amount that is the case so let us see how the image quality and image size will affect the bust rate we are choosing raw as image quality and image size as large as we are shooting in fastest shutter speed your camera going to capture the images like 5 to 60 images in faster way and later on the frame rate gets reduced this is because the buffer present in your camera fill up with images at this time the camera slow down the frame rate in order to move the images that are present in buffer to the memory card initially you are able to capture continuously 10 images then it will reduce the frame rate to 5 like you might be getting a 5 images instead of that because buffer got filled up and we are allowing it the buffer to move its images the images present in the buffer to the memory card So whenever buffer gets emptied it is again capable of capturing images continuously as long as the buffer fill up again so this is the iterative process that takes behind the every camera and every camera has its own buffer for higher end cameras it has bigger buffers when lower end cameras it has small smaller buffers like if you have seen example 5200320003100 and d90 and if you take higher end cameras like 
Nikon Z7 is one of that. Sony, Sony Alpha 9, Sony Alpha 7 Mark III, Nikon Z7, UASR of Canon. These cameras have higher bust rates. That means they are much capable of capturing images continuously. That means they, those cameras are very very useful in doing wild photography and just you wanna whenever you wanna just capture the images of sports photography. So a lot of people might not notice uh, what's, be, what's happening behind the camera but this is what happening behind the camera. So thanks for watching my video. Signing off. You are Saidi Paishala. Bye for now. Have a nice day.